it was okay turn to here and also happy happy fifth of november happy bonfire night i will be watching fireworks in my open window all right let's get to my predictions for tonight's event and that's wwe crown jewel well usually that's not even i never get excited off i never get somehow i never get excited for sorry maybe events Okay, even though we had one, we had an incredible match last year between that Heaven and Soul match between Seth and Edge. That was a great match. But let's just get to my predictions. Okay, then we got a rematch from, from, a rematch from war. And that's, uh, you, you take team champs? Alexa Bliss and Oscar takes on damage control. And that's <laughs> the Kurokai and Eos guy. We'll have to, Oscar and Bliss won the tag themselves on war on Halloween. <laughs> Well, it was like damage control, god damage. <laughs> okay, I respect damage control, I really respect them, but I want Oscar and, Oscar and Bruce to return. <laughs> okay. Then we have six man tag team match as the OCs. The OCs? <laughs> Gallows and AJ Styles takes on Judgment Day. Oh. Well, I want the OCs to win it because, like I said, like AJ said, they have a way up problem. Yeah, I agree with him, because where he always gets involved, and I'm getting tired of it. I'm hope, and that's what I'm hoping. No, I want UFCs to win the match, but I'm hoping they got they got back their backup plan, someone someone to deal with we are. Because I hear rumors, and I'm hoping it's true. Even if it, if it comes true tonight, or they may say it for war, I'm hoping I heard rumors that a former WWE superstar got released during the pandemic may make a return. And the women think it could be Mia Yim. Mm hmm. It could be her. Well, if it's her or someone else, I just want that whoever it is, just want to kick me his butt and tell her to back off, sister. Mm hmm. So, like I said, I want the old seeds to win. Too sweet. <laughs> Alright, next. So, this is why he's gonna, I predict this why he's gonna keep going on and on and on. <laughs> and I'm telling you that Drew McIntyre versus Kenny and Cross. But this time, Inside a steel cage. Ooh. Since the strap match in Extreme Rules didn't work for Drew, because usual, Scott gets involved. Well, we're hoping this steel cage match works, because I want Drew to win. You don't mess with a Scottish warrior. <laughs> okay, next we got a tag team championship match as the Usos defender undisputed tag team titles against the Boring Brutes. Well, we matched they had the SmackDown last month. Well, this is going to be interesting, because remember, the Usos, they are getting close. They are getting close of beating the New Day's record. But only question is, even if the Usos does retain tonight, does retain it tonight, they need to get past the New Day, since they'll, the winner of this match will face the New Day next week on SmackDown for the tag team titles. Ooh. Okay, I w really want the Boring Blues to win. I really want them to win, but I got a feeling the Usos are going to retain again. <laughs> Okay, next we got who? An interesting one, and that's two a monster versus a giant, <laughs> and that's Almas versus Strowman. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be an interesting one, and I really don't know who I think is gonna win because yeah, Strowman he's a monster, but Almas he's big. <laughs> uh, come on, for a couple of weeks already did so far, get them ready to face each other. It's Taking down jobbers after jobbers after jobbers after jobbers. Man, it's like 2016 all over again. <laughs> so, I really don't know who I think is going to win between these two. <laughs> oh, David was <Vizcoliath. laughs> I don't know. Okay, next. Oh, this match is going to be really good. I think this match is going to be good. And I'm talking about Black Lesnar versus Bobby Lashley. Finally, just a normal single match, single match between these two. Nothing to do with titles and no interference. <laughs> well, this is, this is gonna okay. Cause when uh, last time these two faced each other was back in January at Royal Rumble, it was for the title, it was for the title, and there was interruptions. But this one would be much. I think this one would be much better. Oh, this is tough. I don't. I don't. This, again, this is tough for me. I don't know. Cause last time I predicted, last time I predicted Brock Lesnar to win, and he didn't. But this one, I don't know. Because, like I said, I love Cowboy Muslim. <laughs> and I respect Lashley. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> so, it doesn't matter whoever wins. Whoever wins. Okay. This is the match I'm looking forward to see. And I think this could be the maybe the best, maybe the match of the night. 
And then think about he used to be Uncle Billy. She depends on all women's time against Bailey again. But this time, and the last woman standing match. <laughs> okay, I think this is the third time we got a last woman standing match. Because remember, the first one was an NXT, Oscar versus Nikki Cross. Then the second one was Becky Lynch versus Charlotte at Evolution. And now the third one, Bianca and Bailey at Crown Jewels. Ooh. I, you know, I love and respect Bailey, especially what she is now. But, huh, I'm question, can she prove Bianca wrong? Can she win a match? Can she win a match and beat Bianca all by herself without her damage control? But, trust me, I know Bailey. She'll have her damage control back up. If they sh if they show up in the in a match, I'll say this once again, Bailey. You proved that Bianca was right. But I'm sticking to my prediction. I'm just an EST to retain. Hmm. Okay, time for the main event. Ugh. Okay, I, I, I've been saying this for so many, for a couple of weeks now. Huh? And I'm sticking to my words. This is a match I'm not gonna watch. But I'll just say my predictions. And I'm talking about Roman Reigns as he defends his undisputed Universal Championship match against Logan Paul. Okay, I respect Logan. I totally respect him. And he totally impressed me. Totally impressed, not just me, he impressed me and the entire WWE of his wrestling skills this year. Come on. He totally impressed with his first two wrestling matches this year for WrestleMania and SummerSlam. But against Roman, are you kidding me? Have you, well, you see what's been happening for the past two years? Travel Chief, longest reign champion. 10,000 days plus has not, not been pinned? Oh. Oh, yeah, true, yeah, because remember. Yeah, true, Logan will have his brother, Jake Paul, but hello, you only have one person, Logan. Logan, he has his blood wine. The entire blood wine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the entire blood wine. So, I'm just going to say this quick. Logan's going to retain. Logan's going to retain. The match is going to be squash. I just know it. And I'll be watching the fireworks during that match. I'll mute it and just watch the fireworks. <sighs> Okay, so Crown Jewels, in our time in the UK, it starts at 4 o'clock. Well, so I'll be watching it while I'm having my dinner. <laughs> Alright, so, catch you later.